want him to take as many shots as possible tonight. Chicago, in losing to Houston on Sunday, shot less than 40%. Jordan gets his first of the night. At the end of a road trip, he expects to be back Sunday at home against Miami. Here's Jordan posting up again. That's the downfall of Chris Childs guarding Michael this. Jordan. Michael Jordan is just bigger. He's stronger. He can jump higher. And on the post, Chris Childs needs help. But the Bulls don't like giving help, so he's probably going to be down. Chance for the Chicago Bulls to get their first lead of the night now. Ewing knocks it right back into the hands of Mr. Jordan. Good defense, bad luck. A 7 nothing Chicago run, and the Bulls are up by two. No, no. Underneath, another turnover. That's three turnovers for New York in their last five possessions. Here's Jordan. Jordan and Pippen have scored all of the Chicago points. You talk about bad breaks. Patrick Ewan deflects the ball. It goes back to that man wide open to the basket. You're not going to stop him. Right in his hands. And as you looked at the replay, Randy Brown. That's probably why Van Gundy wanted them to shoot so quickly. <laughs> it limits their chances of turnovers. Five turnovers in the last eight possessions. On a quicker guy. Or, or harder defense on a quicker guy. Jason Caffey off the dribble. Finds Jordan. 20 points for Jordan. Guarded by Charlie Ward. Jordan. Now Larry Johnson with the switch. I tell you, he's feeling it. You can see his face. Yeah, his conversation with Jordan and Childs that... Uh, Wennington, Caffey, and Kukoc. Wennington. Jordan with a spin move finds Kerr for a quick three. And that's the other guy. Yep. And, the and Pippen for the Bulls. Jordan for the Bulls. Chicago. Here's Randy Brown. He got the start tonight. Here's Jordan. Nobody there to guard him. Oh, wow. What? Nobody. Oh, what a breakdown. Rebounds for Ewing. And here's Houston. He can't find one. Yeah, that, that's just when everything goes wrong. He gets a point blank layup and misses. At the other end, Jordan makes him pay. Allen Houston, 5 of 16 yesterday afternoon in the garden, is 1 of 11 tonight. Michael Jordan has 29. He's going to struggle. You need Larry Johnson to get it off offensively. Giles back on Jordan. Jordan has 34. Stopped by Patrick Ewing. Exactly what the Knicks want. They got to quicken their offense, and they went to Patrick Ewing. With Bill Winnington on them, you got to keep going there. And with Chris Childs, oh my, and spread Jordan. the floor and try to make the Bulls double team Patrick Ewing so they're good guys and get threes. The problem is you got to throw it in the post run. Yeah. Great play by Michael Jordan. Great play. Yeah. They doubled Patrick Ewing and got the turnover. Back to Wennington. Oh, he loves that shot. Yes, he does. Randy Brown kicks it out to Jordan for three. Oh, oh. another wide open shot for Michael Jordan. He's scoring a ton of points, and he's not having to work very hard for him. You're not going to win a lot of basketball games giving Michael Jordan easy shots. Michael Jordan has led the way to an 18 to 4 Chicago run. 39 points for number 23. Williams off balance shot. Jordan with another rebound. And that's not the shot you want by Williams. I think he felt he got pushed a little bit. Oh. Underneath the cappy. Yeah, I mean, you look at it, he's doing everything right now. He sees the court, he's feeling it. Uh, but when a guy's that wide open, Burton, you could have made that one. I'm pretty sure of it. Bulls get to all the loose balls. They get to them before their guys do, and, and that's hurt the team, and that one was a big one. Jordan. Shooters roll. Off the screen set by Jordan. Allen Houston guards him. Michael, three moves, and a basket. And this time he glances at you. Yeah, he should. He should glance at all of us. He, we call that Jimmy, Jimmy Clark's not going to do it. Here was Jordan. Oh, I mean, that, that, the, the move was great. And, and, and as a defender, it's really not a court. That helps tremendously. 
Ewing's first bucket in the fourth quarter. 1-10 to go. Jordan in the post over Houston. Oh. Oh, golly. And they said he wasn't going to get the shot. Jordan with 49. Jordan now has 51. And he is screaming at Jeff Van Gundy. And yeah, he's still uh, he's He was not going to pass that ball. He had every intention to shoot it. Guys on the Bulls are running around. He never even looked. That was his shot all the way. Well, Phil, uh, well he's a snake right now. I'll tell you that. <laughs> You feel that's the case, that sometimes guys want to be his friend a little too much? Yeah, I do. I really do. Uh, I, I, as a player, you don't want to talk to guys, and I think Michael Jordan does a great job of that. I think Isaiah Thomas did a great job. I think Magic Johnson did a great job. You You're going guys. against the best player probably in NBA history. At the buzzer, the basket goes, but here's a surprise. Michael Jordan has been selected as our Bud Light player of the game. <laughs> Final score, 88-87. The basket at the buzzer did count. That cuts the margin to one. But the New York Knicks fall to Chicago in the first of four games this year. They're 28 and 12. And let's check in with Dick Versace. Mike, did they tug on Superman's cape today? Well, I, I felt a good rhythm tonight offensively. And, uh, you know, we didn't really have a great rhythm tonight. And, you know, times I just had to use my athletic, uh, athletic ability and take one-on-one -on -one a lot of times, and I was able to make some big shots. What was going on? I talked to Phil before the game, and he said, Mike might get 45 or 50 tonight. How come he predicted that? Well, I know we were coming off an uh, you know, embarrassing loss against Houston, and, uh, you know, we were coming back facing a, a team that you know, really has given us troubles over the last couple of years, and, you know, I just felt psyched up for the game, and, you know, I came in with a, a lot of motivation to get, get back on the winning track and play my heart out. Yeah, I noticed on the last basket, you took a hard look at the Nick bench. I did. <laughs> Thanks, Mike.